Geeks here, making more videos again, and today guys, we got another cool unboxing for you. So without further ado, let's get to it. So this right here, guys, is called the eBook 2, and they're from this company, Jumper. You might have heard of them, you might have not. I've been finding a lot of interesting things on GearBest that, are, you know, like the prices are so low. Like, look at this, this is this is under $200 for this laptop. I haven't opened it yet, but I think I'm gonna love it because I saw the reviews and, you know, just cannot wait to unbox this. But yeah, the website basically has stuff that's from China and brands that you haven't heard of, or you might have. A lot of people do know this brand, Jumper, but they're a pretty good brand, so without further ado, let's unbox this. Oh. All right, so first things first, you have, you're greeted with this box right here. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. All right, nothing else in the actual box. There's some literature in the actual box right here, but probably never gonna read this. Put that box down. So this laptop, as you can already see, it's supposed to mimic the MacBook Air, okay? Not the MacBook, not the MacBook Pro, but the MacBook Air. It's supposed to look like it has a style to it, except it has windows. I love the Mac laptop look. Okay, their, their look is amazing. They just, it just looks awesome. So I wanted to find something that's super cheap, but yes, it has the same look with the same speed. Oh man, this laptop is lightweight, like no weight at all. Real quick, I wanna show you what's in the actual secondary box right here before I even move on. Okay, so this is the actual power cord right here. As you can see, it's really small. It doesn't have a huge bulky, you know, AC, DC converter. It's just really small like this. Uh, this is really nice because it keeps intact with the lightweight and small minimalistic laptop that we have here. So I'm gonna put this to the side. We're gonna definitely be using that later on. Already guys, I am really loving this thing. Oh my gosh. It's a big sticker. So first off, as you can already see, I'm trying to look in the actual camera to show you guys this, is the, the thin part right here, and just like a MacBook Air, it goes from thin to thick, as you can see. It's just like, it's exactly similar to a MacBook Air. The actual look of it, I mean, if someone was holding this around, if you didn't see this jumper logo right here, you would really think that this is a, a MacBook Air. So right off the back, I can already tell. Look at, I mean, I'm, I'm like throwing this thing in the air. This thing is lightweight, and I'm actually reading right here that it is 1.2 kilograms, or for us in the US, 2.5 pounds. That's pretty light. It almost feels like one of the biggest tablets from, you know, Apple's lineup. Like that one tablet I gave away months ago. That's how light it feels like. So right now on the side of the laptop, real quick, I'm gonna show you SD card slot right here, headphone jack, and also you have a USB 2.0 uh, you know slot and then when I show you on the front there's nothing on the front really when I go to the side right here You do have an HDMI mini port It's 3.0 USB port right here that actually is a 3.0 port and you have the AC uh, Charger you actually plug this guy into that guy. It does have an indicating LED right here That's red when it's charging etc. etc. So that's really nice looking on the back real quick as you can see it's a really sleek design It just it looks very I mean already guys. I'm loving the look of this thing It looks really thin really compact and you know Hopefully when I test it out hopefully when I turn it on this is gonna be my daily driver for less than 200 bucks That is pretty good. So you got two speakers on the back. We're gonna test out the sound I want to see how it sounds maybe uh, because I know they're on the back um, It's a cleaner finish I guess because you know you don't see any speaker holes and these are like where the sound is coming from kind of like a Mac, but uh, we'll see how that goes. Also, it has four rubberized uh, feet right here. Definitely, that's a plus because to keep it from not moving around. You know, it has some screws and stuff, but other than that, it's completely, uh, this bottom part, I can tell it feels like aluminum. It looks like aluminum. However, it is plastic. It's And it's not a cheap plastic or anything like that. I mean, it looks great. I like the feel of this. Last but not least, I'm gonna show you on the top right here. This is the jumper logo right here. And this actually does light up. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna actually turn off these lights or turn them down and show you that these, this thing actually does light up. So without further ado, let's actually open this guy up. I'm actually curious to see how the keyboard looks. Oh, first of all, I already felt that there's a magnet right here. There are two, probably two magnets or whatever right here holding this down. And it's a really nice feel like that. And let me take this off. Not bad, looking nice. Look at, I mean, seriously, look at that. I mean, if I show you to you on the camera, I'm looking at the camera right here, that actually looks like a MacBook Air. That's, and like, seriously, it looks really nice. Now, I do know that they do have some metal right here, obviously, because this hinge is actually really nice, okay? It feels 
pretty good. It, like, I, I'm not kidding you. Like, it feels good. It, look, it feels sturdy. It doesn't feel like weak or anything like that. And also, this right here, everything looks aluminum on this part right here. However, it is not. It, I mean, it even feels aluminum, but it's not. It's actually plastic. So, you know, you're going to you're gonna love the feel, basically. It's not going to feel bad or anything like that when you actually get it. It does have microphones right here and also some status LEDs right here, power, etc., etc. This is a really nice trackpad also. I mean, it feels great already. And also, now, th this whole thing does not click. However, there are two buttons right here, as you can you can hear it there, you know, the right click, I mean the left click and also the right click is right here. And also obviously it has all this functionalities like, you know, scrolling with two fingers and stuff that Windows 10 has. So real quick, let me, let me see if it even has power. So you press the power button right there. Oh, it's a, oh yeah, there it is. Okay, so it does have power. Real quick while it's turning on, I want to tell you that this is a Windows is turning on. This is this has fully Windows. That's one of the things I'm gonna tell you. It is fully activated Windows 10. Okay, so you don't have to worry about activating. You don't have to worry about buying a product here and things. So that itself right there is worth the price of the laptop. Next, I want to tell you about the screen right here as it's actually turned on. As you can see, that was actually fairly quick actually. And uh, but a lot of people said on, on reviews on actually type the reviews on the website itself. They said that it is a pretty fast load up, uh, and and I could tell it's really fast. Now it does have a 14 inch screen. This is a 14 inch screen. And this is a 19. 20 by 1080p LED screen. So I'm going to be reading right there. It actually has the Intel Cherry Trail uh, processor. It has RAM of four gigabytes RAM. I've actually seen people uh, play video games on here. You know, actual games, uh, Rocket League, whatever. Now they're not running it at the highest setting. However, I, you know, for come on, that's what you expect for for a laptop that's less than 200 bucks. Uh, it has a hard memory of 64 gigabytes. But for my purposes, I'm going to be definitely using the SD card and putting it in here. Uh, I'm I'm basically gonna buy like a 128 gigabyte SD card and just hop it in there and you know there you go I have 128 gigs on this laptop. It's obviously has Wi-Fi and also it has Bluetooth. This is the reason why I got this guy okay I wanted you guys to see something that costs less than $200 however has all of these functions the basic functions that you might need for a quick simple thin laptop. Now in my case I'm definitely gonna be using this laptop for browsing the web checking my email typing some things you know, doing some doing some light work stuff uh, that is not on my phone. However, it's on a laptop, and, it, and and I want it to look good. I want it to you know look modern, look sleek, and you know and be really thin. That's what I want it to be. So real quick, let me turn off the lights right here, and you can see the logo actually does light up. Alrighty, guys. So it's been about I'd say. 25 minutes or so. I've been playing around with this laptop, checking everything, you know, making sure it's activated, etc. etc. And it is activated. It's Windows is running Windows 10. And I did update to the latest update right now. And I've been doing all of this completely on battery. And another thing what I want to tell you is that speaking of battery, uh, Jumper does say that this thing can last six hours with using straight video. Right now the laptop is at 73%. However, it's saying that there's seven hours and 39 minutes left on it. So that just gives you an idea. So real quick, I also tried out the keyboard and I have to say uh, this keyboard, I'm just gonna do some typing so you can hear how it sounds. It's fairly quiet and also the fact that this actually has a lot of key travel. So you know when you actually push the key down, it goes down and it has a jumpy, it almost feels like a mini mechanical keyboard or something. The keys actually jump back at you. So it gives you that feel of, you know, you clicked it, you let go. So it actually feels kind of nice. I want to also test out the actual sound of this thing. I just put a song on here. So let's see how it is. Uh, let's turn up the volume all the way up. It has a shortcut right here. So let me turn it up all the way to 100%. It is on 100%. And also let me turn up the volume on YouTube. It's on 100% on everything. So let's see how it actually sounds. Okay, so it's not bad. It definitely has almost close to zero bass. However, it does have good treble. It has good sound quality. Now, if you do want the best sound, obviously you want to use some headphones. You want to plug it into the actual, you know, headphone jack uh, that this laptop has and then just listen to some good music. But if you're listening on the go, uh, it's not bad. It's not the loudest that I've heard on a laptop. It, like I said, it's not bad at all. So right now I've been using this laptop and I can tell that this screen is actually really nice. 1980 by 1080 LED, 
I think that's really good. Now the big question I wanna ask myself and also I wanna tell you is, is this going to be my daily driver? Surprisingly, for less than $200, I would love to make this my daily driver, guys. Now, like I said, I've been using this thing for some time now and I've been browsing the web. I downloaded Chrome, as you can see, this is Chrome. For my purposes, definitely it's doing the job. It's, it's not laggy at all, it updates fine. I think Jumper really has something right here, guys, and I think you should check it out. It's an easy book too. If you are interested in purchasing this product the links are in the description below it's a really sleek product you know very modern looking and that's one thing what I wanted I wanted a really thin modern Bluetooth HDMI really high resolution display for a really small compact laptop with some good processing power that I can do my everyday tasks and if I wanted to maybe even play some games and that's what I wanted in a everyday laptop and I think this is definitely going to be my next everyday laptop and like I said guys for for less than 200 bucks I think that is a steal now the great part is you won't find this laptop on Amazon or anything like that you find it on gearbest.com like I said the links are in the description below all the detailed specs of this product are gonna be in the description you know there's a ton of specs I could go all day however I don't want to be boring you guys out with specs I wanted to show you guys a sleek clean laptop that looks awesome that might actually be of interest to you I travel a lot and I cannot wait to take this on my trips I think this is a great laptop for people that are in college really cheap low budget and it will definitely get the job done so overall guys, I'm loving this easy book too from Jumper and I know you will love it But that's pretty much it for the video guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it links are in the description below like always There should be another video popping up right there Make sure you click on it enjoy it there for you to watch but other than that guys keep your share saying thanks for watching it Peace